welcome back let's take one more example how to convert a context free grammar into the greeback normal form the given grammar is a1 tends to a2 a3 let's take it is equation 1 then a2 tends to a3 a1 slash b equation 2 then a3 tends to a1 a2 slash a equation 3 Convert this context free grammar into the Greeback normal form is question. Okay. As you know, first step is first simplify the grammar, then convert into the Chomsky normal form is the first step. Okay. You, you consider this. There is no epsilon productions. There is no unit productions. A3 derives A, A2 derives B, so that A1 is also derives AB. A2, A3 are reachable to the A1. So the given grammar is in simplified form and you know Chomsky normal form exactly two non terminals then one terminal only so the given grammar is in cnf is already so the given grammar is in simplified form and cnf now convert this grammar into the greeback normal form so we have to rename the variable as you observe already variables are with a1 a2 a3 so no need rename the variables again then second step is uh, a crucial point in solving this problem is choosing a equation is important as we know choose a equation or production such that i is greater than j i is greater than j so i mean left hand side variable subscript is greater than right hand side starting variable subscript so based on this this is one is uh, less than two it is not okay then two is less than 3 it is not now it is 3 3 is greater than 1 so that we can take equation 3 now how we can write equation 3 is so take this one equation 3 how we can write it as a3 tends to a1 a2 slash a okay then so yes I'm asking so which lemma you can apply you we know we have substitution lemma and elimination of the left recursion lemma lemma one lemma two so which lemma we can apply is now substitute a1 productions a2 a3 in a3 production okay so now it is a3 tends to now substitute in place of a1 these productions it is a2 a3 a2 slash a okay so now a3 is this equation now now substitute a2 productions a3 a1 b in a3 equation so how we can return it as a3 tends to a3 a1 then a3 a2 slash then substitute b so b a3 a2 slash a right so now this is of the equation this is of the left recursion i mean we now we can apply lemma 2 so this is a this is a and it is alpha 1 it is beta 1 it is beta 2 okay now introduce new non terminal instead of a dash instead of a dash regularly i am taking as z only i am taking z in order to avoid the confusions okay so how how i can write it written it as now a3 tends to beta 1 what is beta 1 this is b a3 a2 beta 1 a dash now i take in a dash is what z so z slash then beta 2 what is beta 2 a z slash beta 1 what is beta 1 b a 3 a 2 slash beta 2 a then so now z tends to z tends to alpha 1 what is alpha 1 a 1 a 3 a 2 into z slash alpha 1 what is alpha 1 a 1 a 3 a2 okay now you observe a3 productions are converted into the greeback normal form so what is the form of the greeback normal form a tends to 
ये एक्स और ये टेंस टू ये ओनली सो टर्मिनल फॉलोड बाई एनी नंबर ऑफ नॉन टर्मिनल्स और एक्जैक्टली सिंगल टर्मिनल ओनली सो एज पर दिस ए थ्री इज कन्वर्टिंग टू द ग्री बैक नॉर्मल फॉर्म यू ऑब्जर्व सो नाउ सब्सिट्यूट ए थ्री प्रोडक्शन इन ए टू प्रोडक्शन सो इक्वेशन टू टेंस टू ए टू टेंस टू ए थ्री ए वन स्लैश बी ओके नाउ सब्सिट्यूट ए थ्री प्रोडक्शन इन ए टू प्रोडक्शन आई मीन सब्सिट्यूशन लेम आई एम अप्लाइंग यू लेम वन ओके सो दैट ए टू इज कन्वर्टेड इन टू सो ए टू टेंस टू सब्सिट्यूट बट फर्स्ट दिस वन बी ए थ्री ए टू जेड इन द प्लेस ऑफ ए थ्री आई एम आस्किंग यू टू सब्सिट्यूट ओके सो ए वन स्लैश देन सब्सिट्यूट ए जेड सो इट इज ए जेड ए वन स्लैश नाउ सब्सिट्यूट बी ए थ्री ए टू सो बी ए थ्री ए टू ए वन देन सब्सिट्यूट ए सो नाउ इट इज ए ए वन स्लैश वॉट इज रिमेन इंप्रोडक्शन बी सो नाउ यू अब्जर्व ए टू प्रोडक्शन आर आलो कन्वर्टेड इन टू द ग्री बैक नॉर्मल फॉर्म ये स्टार्ट विथ टर्मिनल स्टार्ट विथ टर्मिनल स्टार्ट विथ टर्मिनल स्टार्ट विथ टर्मिनल एक्सैक्टली सिंगल टर्मिनल ओके देन वॉट आर द प्रोडक्शन नॉट कन्वर्टेड इन टू द ग्री बैक नॉर्मल फॉर्म इज ए वन प्रोडक्शन ओके नाउ सब्सिट्यूट ए टू इन ए वन प्रोडक्शन सो नाउ टेक इक्वेशन वन A1 वन टेन्स टू ए टू ए थ्री नाउ सब्सिट्यूट आल दिस वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव प्रोडक्शन इन दि ए टू प्लेस इन ए वन प्रोडक्शन नाउ इट इज ए वन टेन्स टू बी ए थ्री ए टू जेड ए वन आस्किंग टू सब्सिट्यूट दिस वन देन ए थ्री स्लैश देन दिस वन ए जेड ए वन ए थ्री स्लैश देन सब्सिट्यूट दिस वन बी ए थ्री ए टू ए वन ए थ्री देन सब्सिट्यूट दिस वन ए ए वन ए थ्री देन सब्सिट्यूट लास्ट वन बी सो बी ए थ्री नाउ यू अब्जर्व ए वन आज आल्सो इज कन्वर्टेड इन टू द ग्री बैक नॉर्मल फॉर्म बिकॉज स्टार्ट विथ टर्मिनल स्टार्ट विथ टर्मिनल 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 start with the terminal only okay then what are the productions that are not converted into the greeback normal form is only z productions okay now take the z productions so z tends to a1 a3 a2 z this is one production and rewrite it as second production z tends to a1 a3 a2 now substitute a1 productions in z production so in the place of a1 you can substitute in the place of a1 you can substitute now write down parallelly so how it is becomes is yeah z tends to for substitute this one b a3 a2 z a1 a3 then what is this a3 a2 z then substitute same thing in this production also so z tends to b a3 a2 z a1 a3 then a3 a2 yeah this is complete then substitute this one so z tends to a z a1 a3 then a3 a2 z then z tends to a z a1 a3 then a3 a2 so this is also completed then substitute this this production now z tends to b a3 a2 a1 a3 then a3 a2 z then z tends to b a3 a2 a1 
a3 then a3 a2 so this is also completed then take the this one a a1 a3 now z tends to a a1 a3 so remaining part is a3 a2 z then z tends to a a1 a3 so remaining is a3 a2 so this is also come to last one is b a3 so z tends to b a3 so remaining is a3 a2 z then z tends to b a3 so remaining is a3 a2 a3 a2 so this is also completed okay now you observe all z productions are also converted into the greeback normal form all are starting by terminal only okay so hence the given grammar is this one okay so convert into the greeback normal form a3 productions a2 productions a1 productions and z productions so this is how we can convert a given context free grammar into the greeback normal form